windy, Darren. It's going to be windy as hell, guys. This, this wind is so bad. So I apologise about the wind. Brenda, how's it going? Ooh, we're out in the middle of the sea here. Tinkerbell. This is the Irish Sea. We're on the end of the pier and it's so windy. So windy. Hold the phone tightly. I know, it's so windy. Billy, how's it going? We're in the middle of the sea here. Nice sea. It's actually a nice day. It's about 17 degrees, but it's like very windy. But it's not cold, is it? It's just like the wind isn't cold. It's uh... Hi everybody, says Rachel. I think she's still upset because she got beat last night at Monopoly. So yeah, we've just been in this little arcade here. There's like a little games arcade. Um, the tide be in. Yeah, the tide's in. We were going to have a walk on the beach, but the tide's in, so we can't do it. This, uh, hi Emma. The, um, I think this pier, I haven't read up on it because I can't remember, so I might be a bit wrong. I think it's the second longest pier in the UK and it's um, extremely windy, <laughs> extremely windy on the end of it. Hello John, hello Rick. But it's quite a nice day today, it's actually I'm actually warm. Warm. So we've just been in this like arcade, yeah, games arcade and we're gonna go and get some uh, Chips, fish and chips from from the bottom. You scoped it the other week, did you, Rick? I never saw that. Did you come down onto the pier? It is nice. It's like a kind of nicer version of Blackpool. Yeah, it's sunny. What's the what's the wind like, guys? I'm covering the mic, but it's it's uh, some of the old kind of games and stuff. Oh, I did a couple of years ago, Brenda, yeah. Yeah, we saw the swans on the way, Rick. There's a black swan we saw as well. The wind's fine. Wow, surprised. I thought it would just be completely... I am covering it, but... Hello, Lindy. Hello, Rita. Black swans matter, they do. They do. So, yeah, we're going to head back down to the end of the pier. It's a bit weird noise. You lost your hearing because of it. Move your left hand. I'm trying to hold the phone without the wind blowing it off so that's why it's not perfect today. So this, um, you never been. This pier goes on for freaking ever. It goes well past the beach and the roads and everything. It goes on for ages. Oh, was there a protest on here, right? You love peers. Yeah, we've just been in the arcade, yeah. Yeah, no, this is free, free to walk on. You don't need to to uh, pay. Um, there is like a kind of fun fair over there that way. Mufi, how's it going? The beach was closed. The beach was closed. Well, the tide's in at the moment, so... Uh, how's it going, Mufi? Hello, Adam, how's it going? The very end of the pier. Yeah, that's where we've just been. This is the very end of the pier here. Where the wind is blowing. I mean, if I had hair, my hair would be blowing now. <laughs> but I don't have hair. Can you see Blackpool? Yeah. Uh, you can normally, I think, see the tower. Oh yeah, you won't be able to see it but it's very 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 in the distance you can see the tower very yeah Blackpool's that way very very far, faintly in the distance you can see it now I want to go to Blackpool all the ice cream places were open yeah last time I came here the um the beach was all the way out like well past the pier and you could walk along all of this See, how's it going? On a holiday? No, I'm not on a holiday. It's like an hour down the road from me. So, UK's second longest pier. Yes, I got that fact correct then because I just said that, and I said I, I said I might be wrong, but I think it's the second longest pier in the UK, and 
I was right. No, I'm not using a mic, am I? But I wasn't going to scope, but I just... I said it's probably too windy anyway, but I just did it. Um, and I'm just covering the mic, so... I'm amazed. I'm amazed. Loads of razor clams, nice. Pick some up on the way home. Uh, but yeah, it's actually quite nice south, but it's, um, there's, when you get to the bottom of the pier here, there's like, um, a boating lake, um, and, uh, kind of gardens and pubs and things. They got rid of the pier tram due to the funds of repairs. I just mentioned the tram, actually, and I said, I wonder if they've just took it off because of all, everything that's going on. I didn't know it was a cost, a cost issue. Yeah, it saves the old legs. So on the other side, I'll show you the left side now because it's... Um, get these patches of... Patches of grass on here. Money bastards. You bloody money bastards. I was going to title the scope Getting Blown on Southport Pier. But I thought I'd better not because my... my uh, Scopes always get marked NSFW, and I thought that's not going to help, is it? So, uh, Mark, how's it going? Grass is moving in, and soon there will be no beach, like the end of the world. It's actually a really cool place. Once, once when the tide is out, you can walk for miles on the beach, and they do all the best kind of. Seafood, not seafood, sea side food like fish and chips and hot donuts, sugar donuts, and all that kind of malarkey. You walk out to five miles, really, it is huge. Sugar donuts, I know the hot ones like. Should try running naked on the pier. Uh, we'll try that next time, Yaddy. <laughs> Prepared to give you food poison, brilliant. Up the beach. Yeah, well, this kind of is the beach, but not. <laughs> These old little huts. It's very, like, kind of traditional British pier looking. It's a cafe, but it's not open, that one. It's like a closed cafe. There is, most of the cafes seem to be open, though. Um, plan was planning next. Summer's vacation on the beach. The hut's brand new. Oh, is it a new one, that one? It's quite nice, isn't it? It's quite a nice hut, that one. Um, look at my hair. So yeah, it's a weird, weird pier this, because traditionally a pier would kind of stop kind of here where we can see the, the, the shoreline, um, but this pier carries on going like into the town, so it's uh, it's quite unusual. Chris, how's it going? But it's quite a cool, uh, it's quite a cool pier really. I'm actually warm. Are you warm? It's okay. I'm actually warm. Chris Rossetti, how's it going? Could be a trap. Um, I, might, I don't. I maybe have to cover the mic as much then as I thought. So, which do you want to go right to the end where we? came in, that chippy places. A shop. Bianca, how's it going? Isn't there a marina on the right? I don't know this. Yeah, there's like a little, um, there's a little, uh, what happened to my book? It's a little, um, boating lake kind of thing on the right hand side here. Brenda said hugs. Do you know about the secret underground street? 
Um, don't think so. I've been under. I have walked under the pier once. Emma says hello, Rachel. Hello. You've not been here in a while, but I don't know about a street. It's very hard wind and some rain, and it's it's quite windy here, Murphy. But um, it's kind of quite a nice breeze. It's warm. So that's the uh, fun ferry bit down there. The share scope option. I don't know, John. Is that knackered? You will walk over it. Oh, will we? I'm not sure. So you've got. Um, so this is where a pier would kind of traditionally end, wasn't it? When you come to like the the town bit, but it carries on. It's very unusual. Sea used to come as far as Lord Street, did it really? Last three, four weeks. I didn't know that, John. There's a chippy off the pier on the right. Yes, we saw that. This does like donuts and stuff in here. Like reclaimed land. Like hot donuts. Fresh donuts. They all smell amazing, don't they? Like donuts. There a bumpy road along the coast yeah we've just driven down last time i came here i got the train um but we drove today and um yeah the golden arches they are mcdonald's pizza and kfc standard um we um the road was so bumpy wasn't it that the road on, along the coast Oh my god, it was like a 50 mile an hour road, I think. I'm sure it was a 50. And it was looked like a new tarmac surface. Probably wasn't new, but it looked kind of new. And it was so bumpy. It's like a... It's like a little ride. It's like a little ride. Rachel was like, I'm going to be sick. deal with car journeys very well at the best of times. No. Never mind bumpy roads. Can we get an ice cream? Billy, we can't fit everything in, you know. 365 day year roller coaster. Yeah, it's weird how it's just not even. So I'll take you as far as the boat in lake, I'll show you this boat in lake and I'll end it down there. We we'll go and get some food. Get a 69, says Brenda. But it goes on forever, this pier. It's like literally the longest walk. Is it built on s sand dunes? Don't, no, I don't think so. <laughs> on the left is an aquarium. What do you mean, weather? Where those were. There's a railway track. I don't know if that's is that still in use. Pleasureland railway track. I don't know if that's in use. It looks quite an old track there. But the um, it's like the song that never ends. It is Billy. It's like the pier that never ends. Um, yeah. But the, the tracks, oh, it's still in use. The railway, the tracks here that you see on the on the actual pier. This is that's the like the mini railway that they have, which uh, well they did have, which which you could get to the to the end of the pier because it's such a long walk. Yeah, these little benches are cute. Scouse accent. Yeah, there's a lot of scouts. We're pretty much basically basically in Liverpool that way. Yeah, I think it's the second longest, Chris, in the UK. It's uh, huge. So we'll show you the boat in Lake here, and then... We'll, uh, it's a little skate park here as well. Skate park. The golf course has been closed down. Oh, this one on the right. Yeah, it looks like it's just a piece of...
can walk until Dublin. Well, Ireland is behind us, yes. Do you want it? Rachel's going to have a go on this. She's going to do some 360s. You can't walk in a straight line, never mind skateboard, Jesus Christ. Imagine you on a skateboard. Christ almighty. Right, we're going to show you the boating lake here on the right now. Just to get past this couple without getting run over. Oh, there's people on the boats now, look. We didn't, we didn't think. Yeah, the swans are on the other side. We didn't think the people were um, on the boats because there was no boats when we walked past, but they're all out now. So you can get on the. See you later, John. Thanks for dropping in. The trolleys used to go on this. Uh, it's a little train, it was a mini train, Brenda, that took you to the end of the pier. A lovely bar on Lord Street. There's loads of swans, isn't there? Show you all the swans on the other side here. Katie, how's it going? It's actually a really nice place, yeah. Got all the swans, there's so many of them. They were all on the opposite side. There's a black swan in here as well. Somewhere you'll see it. Oh, it's right at the front. It's the black swan right there. At the front. So many swans. Yeah, do you know the water is so colourful here as well? Like it's. Are you here last week, Katie? Nice. Oh, it's really green, doesn't it? That water looks major green. Yeah, the other side looks really blue. This bit looks really green. A lot of swans. Fun to have heat and alright Mark, see you later. The swans are coming a whole day. Yeah, there was a black swan on it, it was leading the it was leading the way. Oh, I just saw it then before, but I don't know it's gone now. Is it somewhere? Yeah. Um where the little kid is just right going to be here for like two hours we've got a we, we weren't even planning to come in we just would decided i looked at the weather and this side of the coast was really sunny so i said why don't we just go that side and miss the cloud and then we'll have a couple of hours here and then go back so yeah you can go on these boat trips you can go on these boat trips there's a little boating hut over there which you get it from over there Yeah, it's a really nice day actually. It's, I mean, the wind's calmed down a bit now, isn't it? It's not. The motorboats. Yeah. It's cloudy down there. It's, yeah, it's been lovely here. Get on a boat, we haven't got time yet. That boat sounds like Rachel after a curry. Uh, that's <laughs> Getting away from that girl though. I think she thought she was part of the royal family or something. Like royal wave. It's more like Colourful boats, isn't there, through the archway there, through the bridge? Yeah, this is a pub down by the water here. It's like an old motorbike, yeah. There's a big arcade here, there's like a carousel at the end. You see the carousel there at the end, going round. Brenda, thank you for the super hearts. No, we're not seeing any footballers, Mick.
Yeah, it's a nice place. It's cool. The water looks wet, Chris. It does, doesn't it? Not spotted. You're brighter than you look, Chris. Right, I'm going to leave it there, guys, because we're going to uh, Funland, yeah. We're going to go and get some food. We haven't got a lot of time here, so just thought I'd scope while we're walking backwards. So I'm going to leave you there. Enjoy your day, whatever you're doing. Have fun. And uh, I will see you all very, very soon. Show us the food. It'll only be probably chips or something, yeah,